Hello, hello. Welcome, everybody. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, welcome. How are you? Are you ready? All right, welcome back. Is everybody ready? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Okay, uh, go ahead, Carlos. Tell me what information do you remember about the previous class? The previous class, um, regular and irregular verbs in the simple past, uh, positive and negative statements with uh, this verb. Mm -hmm. Can you give me an example? Um, idea and walk, walk up. Mm -hmm. uh, early this morning. All right, excellent, very good. Can somebody else give me an example of the information that you remember about the previous class? Somebody else, another volunteer? Somebody? We talked about uh, summer activities. Mm -hmm. For example, hi. Oh, we lost your microphone. Uh, we worked with a uh, summer activities in a uh, negative and positive uh, sentences. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In past. Correct. Very good, very good. Hello, Olga, good evening, welcome, how are you? Welcome everybody. All right, guys, so Hello. in today's class, we're gonna go ahead and get started. We're gonna be looking at section number five for section 5.0. By okay. the end of this class, you will be able to form positive and negative statements with the past of the be verb. Additionally, you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Al final de esta clase, ustedes serán capaces de formar oraciones positivas y negativas en pasado con el verbo ser. Además, practicarán una conversación la cual ilustra cómo se utiliza este tema en un escenario de la vida real. Listen, please. Hi everyone. In this class, you learn to form positive and negative statements using the past of be. Additionally, we'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, I was born in Korea. Let's listen and practice. I was born in Korea. Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Hmm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my... My English wasn't very good, so I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good, too. Yeah, but I was born here. All right, we're going to listen to the conversation one more time. Hi, everyone. In this class, you learn to form positive and negative statements using the past of be. Additionally, we'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled I was born in Korea. Let's listen and practice. I was born in Korea. Where were you born, Melissa? 
I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Hmm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good, so I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good, too. All right, everybody listen and repeat. Where were you born, Melissa? Where were you born? Where were you born, Melissa? Oh. I was born in Korea. I was born in Korea. Oh, so you were not born in the U.S.? Oh, oh so you weren't, you weren't born in the US. U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. No, I came here in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Mm, you, you were, were pretty, pretty young. young. Yes, I was only 17. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? Did you, Did you go, to, go college to college right, right away? away? No, my English classes, sorry, oh. no, my English wasn't very good. No, no, my English wasn't, wasn't, very, wasn't good. very good. So I took English classes for two years first. So, so I, took I took English classes, classes for, for two, two years, years first. first. Well, your English is really good now. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. 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 Your Thanks. English is pretty good, too. Your, your English, English is pretty good, good too. too. Yeah, but I was born here. Yeah, yeah but I was born, born here. here. Okay, let me have a Noemi and Sochi. Noemi, you are Chuck, and Sochi, oh, yeah. you are Melissa. Yes, Noemi, Yesenia, and Sochi, Alexandra. Okay, where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to the college right now? No, my English was very good. So I took English, I took English class for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Very good. Excellent. Applause for the participants. <laughs> okay, at this moment, uh, does anybody have any questions related to this vocabulary, related to the pronunciation or something like that? Uh, I have a question. Yes. Uh, what this mean? Is pretty good. Oh, it's... It's, it's pretty good. Pretty Mel good. In Melissa. Yes, it says, uh -huh. thanks. Mm -hmm. Your English is pretty good. Mm -hmm. Gracias. Tu inglés está muy bueno. También, too. OK. Mm -hmm. OK. Uh, preguntaba por la palabra pretty. Ah, OK, yes. Uh -huh. Pretty también puede decir, eh, por ejemplo, tú dices, she is pretty. Ella es uh -huh. bonita. Uh -huh. Y también, uh -huh. eh, Pretty good in este sentido sería muy bueno. Oh, okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. Teacher, Olga. Yes. Eh, ¿Qué significa born? Born, nació. Yeah, but I was born here. Yeah, pero yo nací aquí. Okay, okay. Gracias. Mm -hmm. Thank yes, you. very good. Another question. Another question. Okay, now we are going to work in pairs and practice the conversation for five minutes. Okay. Work in pairs and practice the conversation for five minutes. Okay. Are you ready? Ready. Let's go. Yes.
Ok. Yo la voy a buscar porque no. Ok. ¿Empieza usted o yo? Eh, voy a empezar yo, ¿verdad? Bueno. Eh, voy a hacer el shop. Uh -huh. Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Korea. Oh, Korea. Oh, so you, so you were born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Okay. Well, where were you born, Vanessa? <laughs> I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 19... In... ¿Cómo se dice? 99. 99. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Este, ¿Me lo puedes repetir? Es que fíjate que está cayendo una gran tormenta aquí y casi no escucho. No, 99. 99. 99. 99. Uh -huh. Ok. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right, right away? No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I, I was born here. Okay, seguimos. Yes. <laughs> Empieza. Eh, where, 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 where you're born, eh, Tatiana? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Mm, you, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you, did you go to college right now, right away? No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty, pretty, pretty good too. Yeah, yeah, but I was born here. Where, where were you born, Vanessa? I was born Korea. Oh, so you, so you weren't born in the U.S. No, I came here in 1998, 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English was very good. So I took English classes for, for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was wrong here. Okay. Where were you wrong, Tatiana? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. 
Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right now, right away? <laughs> no, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was wrong here. Where were you wrong, Vanessa? I was wrong in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I can hear it in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English was... Eh, ese was se pronuncia was o wasn't? Wasn't. Porque es wasn't. Uh -huh. Okay. No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Right. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Okay. Where were you born, Tatiana? Um, I was born in Korea. Is everybody finished? Is everybody finished or do you need more time? Finish. Finish. Okay, let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. Mike. All right, Crespin and Olga. Crespin, you are Chuck. Olga, you are Melissa. Okay. Perfect. You begin, Kirsky. Go ahead, Kirspin. Kirspin. Yes, yeah, yeah. Okay. Where were you born, Melissa? Oh, was born in Korea. Oh, so were not born in the USA? No, I came here in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. All right. Awesome. Very good. Olga and Crespin. Excellent. Olga, Thank select you. somebody. Crespin, select somebody. Um, okay. Sandra Maritza. Sandra Maritza is Melissa. Hola. Sandra Maritza, usted va a ser Melissa. Ok. Uh, Rodrigo Antonio Meléndez. All right, Rodrigo Antonio Meléndez is going to be Chuck. Rodrigo Antonio Meléndez is going to be Chuck. Ok, ok, thank you. Action. Uh, Chuck is first. Chuck Rodrigo is first. Okay. Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. 
Mm. You were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English was, wasn't very good, so I took English class for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is very good too. Yeah, but I was born here. All right, good job, guys. All right, guys, now what I would like for you to do is you're going to write a similar conversation and you're going to write it right here. You're going to write a similar conversation in the discussion forum. Any questions? Teacher. Yes, Crispin. Tiene que ser similar, pero con los mismos objetivos que tiene. Por ejemplo, de Corea y todo eso, o lo podemos cambiar todo. Uh, you can change it, but similar, similar, like an immigrant in the United States. Cambiamos entonces eso. That is correct. Perfect. Thank you. All right. Ready? Let's go. It's a very hot, uh, very hot uh, in the afternoon. But ah, I'm excellent. ready to write the sentence on uh, dialogue in, in this platform. Ah, okay. Iniciamos. Okay, yo había hecho uno. Ah, se y si es que estuve trabajando en esto en la tarde. Ah. Pero no hay problema, hagamos otro. Vamos a ver. Ajá. Bueno. Hagamos otro. Creo que se nos unió otra persona más. Ajá, ¿quién está por ahí? Sí, <ríe> hello, hello. Sí, Omara, how are you? Xiomara, hello, hello. Hi. Hi, Xiomara. How are you, Xiomara? Okay, we begin. Um, tal vez eh, podemos hacer una oración cada uno para así participar todos. ¿Qué les parece? Muy bien. Solo se ve poniendo el título uh, a la conversación. Uh -huh. Was and where? Was and where? Iniciemos. Um, los nombres desaparece Chuck. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ponga, póngase usted. Rolandito. Exacto. <risa> Se supone que lo demás es igual. Sí. Y el año que menciona ahí. Ah, también. Okay. Uh, for example, I was born in Mexicanos. Usted estuvo en No, usted es de Mexicanos, sería verdad. Yes, yo nací. I was born in Mexicanos. Uh, I was born in San Miguel. 
O sea, en este caso sería, en vez de preguntarle en presente, where are you from? Tendría que ser... Sería, permítame. Where were you from? Where were you, you born? Where were you bro, bro, eh, where, where were you born? Yes. Uh -huh. where, where were you born? Where were you born? Sería. Y ahí es donde uh -huh. se habla. I, I was born. Y, yes. Pero se... Ah, eso, eso es lo que le iba a preguntar al teacher. Porque acá decía, este, born sería propiamente ya de país o sería... Como, por ejemplo, from es lugar, pero country también como es, es país, entonces se utilizaría word en lo mismo o sería eh, ¿Cómo Porque así? Word... No, no, no entiendo bien la pregunta ah, Este eh, vaya, por ejemplo, eh, word ah, aquí está, gracias este sería propiamente como lugar donde nació sin importar especificar, por ejemplo eh, un un Aquí en San, eh, nosotros nacimos en El Salvador, pero somos de tal, tal departamento. Se puede, ¿Siempre sería lo mismo o sería diferente? A lo mismo. Por ejemplo, usted dice, where were you born? I was born in San Miguel. Ajá. That's okay. Y si quiero decir entonces, uh, ser de El Salvador, se los daría cambiarlo. I was born in El Salvador. Correct. I was born... Uh -huh. In El Salvador. It's okay. It's perfect. Oh. No, no se alteraría para nada el pasado. No, not at all. Porque el verbo es was. Was mm -hmm. y was. Was and where. Correcto. Were para plural. We It, were it's born. Yes. The past verb to be. Correct. The past verb to be. You, we, and they is for if is with where. Correct. I, he, she is with you. Was. That's right. He was and she was and we were and they were. So you weren't born in the Canada? No, I can hear in night, one night. Eh, <laughs> I can't remember. Thousand one. Ah? Two thousand one. No, no. Mm, you were pretty. You were pretty. Le vamos a poner en vez de poner joven, ponemos que estaba usted muy muy chica, muy niña. <coughs> María Inés está ahí. Hola. Estaba, estaba muy pequeña, le voy a poner. Muy 
were you were with small with you were with Se lo voy a poner en el chat. Puede ver el chat. ¿Cómo, cómo lo escribí? Sí. Ahí está ya. Eh, ¿Cuántos años ponemos eh, que tenía? Si gusta, escríbamelo en el chat para que yo le entienda porque le escucho cortado siempre. ¿Cuántos años? Hola. Ajá, ¿cuántos años tenía cuando se vino para San Salvador? Eh, eh, ocho. Ocho años. Eh, yes, I was only Egg. Did you do? Yes. No, no le entiendo. Ahora ponemos que entonces como vino a los ocho años que si fue al a la parvularia. ¿Cómo sería para poner a la parvularia? Mm. Sería la escuela. La escuela. All right, is everybody finished or do you need more time? I need a um, few minutes, please. All right, a few more minutes. Okay, yes.
Is everybody finished? Is everybody finished? I'm going to Hi. Hello, hello. Let me have two volunteers. Let me have two volunteers. Hello, hello. All right, let me have Edwin Gustavo. Who's your partner? All right, Carlos Daniel, who's your partner? Hello, sir. Hey, how, how are you, Carlos? Who is your partner? Um, Linda Estefania. Okay, Linda Estefania and Carlos Daniel. Quiero escuchar su diálogo. Okay, uh, one moment, Linda, are you here? Espera, me quedo live. Oh, I see, yeah. Yeah, okay. Where were you born, Estefania? I was born in France. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I come really in... ¿Cómo se dice ese nombre? 2000. 2000. Um, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English was very good. Well, your well, your English is very good now. <clears throat> Thank you. In me, I <laughs> Thank you. I English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Excellent. Excellent, Linda. Excellent, Carlos. All right, let me have. Uh, Sarai Abigail, who's your partner? Sandra. All right, Sarai and Sandra. Yeah, I can see. Yes. Empieza usted, Sarai. Okay. Where were you? You're born, Sandra. Sigor. I was born in San Salvador. Oh, uh, so you weren't born in the San Pango? No, I come here in Don no le sé cómo se pronuncia. Perdón, no le entendí. 2000. 2000, sí. 2000. 2000. 2000. No, I count here. But 2000. No, I count here in 2000. Mm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 21. 21. 21. Did you go hmm. to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good, so I took English here for one year here. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is very good too. Excellent. All right. Good job. Now let me have Telma Guadalupe. Uh, Thelma, can you hear me? Hello. Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Hola, me escucha? Sí. Okay, very good. Um, can you tell me um, your conversation? Who's your partner? 
Yo la hice yo solita. Ah, ok. ¿Podemos escucharla? Mm. Dice, Daniel, where were you born in Selma? Eh, I was born in Salvador. Eh, Daniel dice, oh, so you were born in the USA? No, I came here to Tucson and one. Mm, Daniel, mm, you were pretty young. I was only 20. Y ahí pregunta Daniel, did you go to college by away? No, my English wasn't very good. Uh, so took English classes for one year, still. Luego dice Daniel, well, your English is really good, no, good now. Thanks. Hasta ahí lo dejé. All right, that's okay. Very good. Hasta ahí la dejé. That's good. That's okay. Good job, Telma. <clears throat> Ok, eh, podemos encender um, la cámara brevemente para tomar la foto de la asistencia, guys, please. Ok. Ready. Take a picture. Everybody say cheese. Okay, one more. Everybody say cheese. Okay, excellent. Thank you. You can turn off your camera now if you want to. And now what we're going to do is I'm going to call your name and you're going to say present for your attendance. Eh, Carlos Daniel. Present teacher. Today is the seventh. Okay, present. Uh, Delmi Saraí. Edgar Wilfredo. Present. Edith Yasmin. Present teacher. Edwin Gustavo. Present teacher. Linda Stephanie. Present. Maria Angelina. Present teacher. Maria Inés. Present. Noemi Yesenia. Present. Olga Lillian. Present teacher. Present teacher. Very good. Oscar Armando. Absent. Paola Maria. Present teacher. Rafael Antonio. Rafael Antonio Morales. Absent. Okay. Raquel Noemi. Present teacher. Raúl Edgardo. Present. René Samuel. René Present. Samuel. Rodrigo Antonio. Present. Rodrigo Daniel. Present. Rolando Rigoberto. Present. Rosa del Carmen. Rosa del Carmen, absent. Ruby Abigail, present. Ruth del Carmen, present. Sandra Martinez, Maritza, present. Maritza, sorry. Saraí Abigail, present. Tania Fabiola, present teacher. Tatiana Beatriz. Present. Thelma Guadalupe. Present, teacher. 
Vanessa Elizabeth. Vanessa Elizabeth. Shomara del Carmen. Present teacher. Soshi Alexandra. Present. Excellent. All right. Now what we are going to do is continue listening to the video. We are going to continue listening to the video. I was born here. Let's take a look at the statements on this chart now. Statements with the past of being. I was born in Korea. I wasn't born in the U.S. You were pretty young. You weren't very old. She was 17. She wasn't in college. We were born in the same year. We weren't born in the same country. They were in Korea in 1998. They weren't in the U.S. in 1998. Contractions Wasn't equals was not. Weren't equals were not. We can follow this formula to form positive statements in the past with be. Subject plus was or where plus complement. We need to remember the following. For the pronouns you, we, and they, we will use where. And for the pronouns I, he, she, and it, we will use was. Now let's analyze a couple of examples. I was born in Korea. First we need to add a subject, I. Then we will use the verb to be in the past, was. Finally we will include a complement born in Korea. Let's do one more example. We were born in the same year. First we need to add a subject we, then we will use the verb to be in the past, where. Finally we will include a complement, born in the same year. Now let's talk about making negative statements in the past with be. We can follow this formula to form negative statements in the past with be. Subject plus wasn't or weren't plus complement. Let's analyze a couple of negative examples. I wasn't born in the US. First we need to add a subject I then we will use the verb to be in the past in its negative form, wasn't. I would like to point out that this is the same as saying was not, but we will typically use contractions. Finally, we include a complement, born in the U.S. Let's analyze one more example. They weren't in the U.S. in 1998. First, we need to add the subject day. Then we'll use the verb to be in the past in its negative form, weren't. I would like to point out that this is the same as saying were not. But we will typically use contractions. Finally, we include a complement in the US in 1998. Now it's your turn to practice making positive and negative statements in the past with being about yourself, friends, and family. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. All right. Now we are going to look at the following one, which is knowledge check. Add the correct form of the verb was, were, or wasn't or weren't to complete the conversations. You will have five minutes and then we will check as a class. Any questions?
let's do it. Teacher, no me apareció la ventana. Oh, really? Let me see. No, ni a mí tampoco, teacher. Okay, let's check it out. Tampoco. Let's check it out. ¿Y ahora? Ahora sí, gracias. Mm -hmm. Seco. Me escucha. Cortado, pero más o menos le escuché. Vaya, voy la número tres. He was born in the U.S. Ah. Born. 
Hi. Hurrah. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Let me have one volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer. My family and I. Where? 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 We. Weren't. 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 I. Was. 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 My parents. Weren't. 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 They. Were. 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 In South Korea, my father was. 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 Any questions? All right, ladies and gentlemen, time is up. Please continue working on the platform. This week, we are going to finish the module. So please uh, try to stay up to date on the activities that we are going to be um, completing. All right. We see you tomorrow. Everybody have a good night. Bye-bye. 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 Take care. Take care. Enjoy the rain.